Okay, shalom, shalom. Om yasha ala. Kuhuloyim la. Yehawah. Bahashem Yahushai. Bahashem Rekha HaKadash. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well. And that by the Spirit taught us this beautiful truth. And just want to say the water to all the Akiyam and Akwath that's out here sincerely keeping the laws and statutes and commandments of Yahweh by Shem Yahushai to the best of their ability. This is Yachanan the Waf. Just coming at you with another quick lesson, praying that it's edifying by the Spirit. And um, another judgment, man, is going forth, man. You know, on a world stage type of deal. Not world stage, but you know, get what I'm saying. Um, this CrossFit trainer or CrossFit guy um, ended up, you know, drowning, I guess, on his last lap of the swim or whatever but anyway let's play let's play the video on the news it's a lot you should be kicking in a community of athletes is in mourning after a competitor drowned at the crossfit games hello everybody i'm heather hayes and i'm steve eager it happened this morning during the swimming portion of the event it's the first time the games have come to texas in this case fort worth and today marked the start of a four-day international competition the athlete who drowned had completed a three and a half mile run and was finishing up a half mile swim fox force dna has the story Steve, the most unfortunate beginning to the CrossFit Games here in Fort Worth. The drowning of one of the competitors. It leaves unclear the remaining schedule. The body of Lazar Dukic was recovered roughly an hour after divers began their search. We had our dive teams come out. We had our arson investigators come out with their drones trying to help locate the, the, the missing person. The distress call went out around 8 a.m. when Dukic, who was swimming within a pack of competitors, vanished near the finish line. An investigation is underway. We're doing everything in our power uh, during this tragic time to support the family, to support our community. Um, we are uh, collaborating, working very closely with the authorities on the follow-on investigation. The vigorous swim was the final leg of the game's opening run-swim event. This, its first time ever in Fort Worth. Before it began, Dukic posted photos of himself on his social media accounts, expressing his eagerness to compete. I recall seeing him at the warm-up area along with all the other athletes and about 6.30 in the morning. North Texan Caitlin Pritchard is a longtime CrossFit sports enthusiast. She was there to watch the event and recorded this cell phone video. I mean, they took off like, you know, a cannon, like I expected they would. It was a three and a half mile run, and I think most of them did it in under 30 minutes, which is incredibly uh, fast on a hot day. She says during the swimming portion, she could see Dukic struggle, but it did not appear to be an emergency. She simultaneously watched the event's live stream on her phone. There was several of them, him included, that looked like they were struggling a little bit in the swim, which is not uncommon. And when they showed him, it wasn't super obvious at that time. It, there were just certain athletes that were changing up how they were swimming and some of them were kind of bobbing. I mean, you could just tell they were tired. Moments later, Pritchard and other spectators were asked to leave the area due to an unspecified incident. A social media post by Mayor Maddie Parker included a statement, in part saying, Our hearts go out to the athlete's family, friends, and the entire CrossFit community. We take pride in being the host city for the CrossFit Games and remain committed to working closely to provide a supportive environment for all athletes, spectators, and visitors. You just don't think that this is this is going to happen. I mean, these are elite athletes, and to think that, you know, 30-ish minutes later, you know, one of the fittest people in the world, you know, is just gone like that. The remaining events today, again, were immediately canceled. The schedule from this point forward is uncertain. And there you have it, man. This is the results of, of Esau Edom's kingdom, man. The, the, the so-called white man's reign. The Greek games, the Roman games, all that bread and circus, man. A bunch of bullshit. You out here running hard as hell on a hot-ass day in Texas. <laughs> you go from that to directly into a pool. I don't even know what, what, probably biking or some shit afterwards. You know, hiking up a damn mountain. You know, this is, this is stuff that Esau Edom... Um, does man and this place is through <laughs> through bro you had um well i don't know the guy uh from the olympics um laos 
his ass ended up, you know, they had to wheelchair his ass off the damn termac. So, uh, <laughs> talking about he caught COVID. i fuck you over there in Paris and caught COVID the night before your race. They, 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 they probably checking for that shit more. They checking for that. You being doped up more than they checking for guns, man. So anyway, boy, I tell you, let's get this one real quick, though, because this does come to mind. Or the spirit. Proverbs 29 and 2. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked beareth rule, the people mourn. See? You got the wicked bearing rule. This motherfucker is just out here just doing all kinds of shit for the, for the, for the sake of sport. Then he want to sell you a damn sports drink. He want to sell you some expensive ass sneakers. Some expensive ass track suits. You know, a cross, a cross trainer bra. The new spandex. And if you've been paying attention to the Olympics, man, them new outfits they got on, they just getting skimpier and skimpier and skimpier by the year. Right? And all this competition shit. You know? These people, these people right here, man, they 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 they'll they'll, you know, won't even work like jobs and shit, you know, to 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 live out there their dream. They call it their dream, right? I seen another article this morning earlier. So like you, bear with me here. Let's see here. A chick, supposedly, she was, <laughs> she, she uh, I think she was a, a chess, a chess player that, that, that was poisoning the, her, her opponent's chess pieces and shit before they got to the damn games. Let's see. Crazy, bro. Oh, here we go. I didn't even have to put it all in. Ru yep, there's a Russian chess player. You know they're going to put Russia on spot anyway. But supposedly, this is her right here. It says she's, um, let's see, they got the video. Yeah, they got some video of this shit. Let's get some video. But, hey, this, <laughs> hey, this, hey, this fucking Esau, man. This is Esau. This is the list that he'll go to, to, you know, just on the strength of, you know, you know, competing. Look at her. <laughs> says chess is the hunger games chess champion um, um, amina Aba, Aba Korova, Korova was caught on camera smearing mercury on rival human got not osmanova's chess pieces causing her to be hospitalized she has been stripped of her title what the fuck you mean stripped of her title y'all ain't arrest that bitch weirdos bro crazy man crazy but hey judgment going out in so many ways man let's go let's go back though let's get this dude around me 32 and 39 i'm at the plantation man just wanted to do something real short and quick because i seen the story pop up i'm like wow well, you know i was thinking like this the olympics <laughs> no, but i mean uh, hey, hey, hey man all this competition everybody wants to compete everybody wants to be uh, 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 you know, just on a world stage of, of, of performing. That's all that this place got to have to offer, man. Deuteronomy 32 and 39. So like you. See now that I, even I am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. See? So we know that it's the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, that set this guy up. You know, the scripture talks about how exercise profit if little. But still, if you ain't got no damn wisdom, you got all them goddamn muscles and you don't have no muscles in your head. To think that, okay, I'm not going to go out here and run three exhaustive miles under 30 minutes and then jump my ass into a swimming pool to, I, I mean, in a damn lake to swim um, an extra half a mile. You know, fucking half, swimming, a half, man, look, just swimming a half a mile is a, a take a toll on you. Swimming ain't no joke, man. Swimming, you're using every muscle on your body. So they just use, you know, a bunch of damn muscle up, running. Then you jump right up and you could catch cramps. He could have caught a damn cramp and went under. That might have could he could have caught one of them hard ass Charlie horses to the back of his leg. But and then again too, the competition is so 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 fierce. What if somebody, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> you know, done something to his ass? So they're going to investigate. They'll see. But anyway, let's get um, Amos 3 and 6. 
Shall there be a trumpet in the, in the city? Shalakia. Shall a trumpet be blown in the city and the people not be afraid? Shall there be evil in the city and the Lord have not done it? See? You got the mayor. Oh, yeah. You know, I just we just want to just send out our condolences to the family and, you know, our CrossFit community. Who the fuck you think CrossFit? You might see a Jake here or there. You might see a so-called uh, uh, and, and more than likely if he's there where well, he looks like a so-called black man, <laughs> he could be a damn tear, man. Because Jake is not into that shit. That's why the scripture talks about Esau being a cunning. Um, he's a cunning hunter. Let me see. And Jacob was a plain man. This is how we know who Esau is, man. Because he, he's into shit like this. He's into hunting. He's into fishing, camping, hiking. Jake not trying. We're not trying to do, man. We're, all we're trying to do is chill. Push up on our lady. <laughs> Have something good to eat, man. Have a drink. You know what I'm saying? Listen to some good ass music. You know, we at the house, man. We <laughs> Don't get me. Hey, but, but see, we live in a society where you know our people they you know they try to join a lot of these sports because jake want to go to the nba they want to go to the nfl you know jake 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 just want to perform and they just, our people are so downtrodden to the point where you know we're just entertainment they, and we and we love to entertain that's how beat down we are we're, we, we're just entertainment you're looking at the olympics right now you 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 really don't see no, all the golds and silvers, all the main medals have been won by so-called black people. See? Genesis 25 and 27, it says, And the boys grew, and Esau was a cunning hunter, a man of the field. And Jacob was a plain man, dwelling in tents. See? We're a plain people, man. We, we ain't into a whole bunch of... We not, you know, yo, why would we need to jump out of a plane, man, talking about skydiving? Bungee jumping and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Thrill-seeking. We're, not, we're generally not, we're not that type of people. Now, don't get me wrong. Like I said, again, you know, you got some, Jake, man. They, they, they you know, they go to these, they, you know, their parents move into these, these so-called white people neighborhoods. They only grew up around so-called white kids. They go to school with so-called white kids, and they'll get into some shit like that. They'll get into a few different things that um, Esau is into. But other than that, you're not about to see Jake out here, man, snorkeling. Jake not out here trying to, um, um you know... Uh, uh, you know, being no goddamn cage, six hundred feet underwater and shit, petting no damn sharks. You know, we, we not, we just not into stuff like that. This is what this man does. He he pushes it to the limit for nothing. He 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 hunts for sport. This man got a bear rug on the goddamn floor. He got moose head, elk head, a deer head, owls and shit stuffed in the motherfucking house. Lion rug in front of the damn chimney. Old ass elephant tusk. You know, just, you know, he done been all over the world hunting for sport. And get this big laugh and super kick out of it, man. It, it, you know, that's that, that's their fun. That's the way that they see life, man. And see, um, and, and that, that's the reason why a lot of them are kind of breaking down right now. Because life as usual for them is not what it is. It, they're not living like how they used to live. This place is breaking down, man. It's breaking down. But yeah, I seen this video with this chick, though. And just to let you know, man, how, you know, um, Esau just wicked as hell. You can't just go and sit down and play damn chess and get your ass whooped if that's the case. You done hospitalized somebody? And then, let me see. I don't even think. Did they say that she get a wreck? They said she, uh, let me see. This is the, uh, this is on X, which is Twitter. Uh, let's see here. Damn. Yeah, you damn Edomites, man. Y'all have something wrong with y'all asses. She tried to poison her opponent by smearing pieces with mercury. The Russian chess player, player is under investigation after allegedly being caught on camera spraying her opponent's board with what authorities said was a substance containing mercury as part of an attempted poisoning ahead of the match last week. She faces possible lifetime ban. Uh, Russian authorities said after the incident during them. Did y'all arrest these bitches? But I'm trying to see. The Federation and kill. Okay, Wednesday on what it said was an attempt to poison a participant. 
It said uh, she has been temporarily suspended from all competitions under the authority of National Federation pending the conclusion of the criminal investigation. The statement linked out to a video of the incident shared of a... Okay, all right, let's see. It says what looked like a room with chessboard set up for a tournament and appearing to rub something on one of the boards before looking around and walking away. Boz reported that the incident took place last Friday during a competition. One of the participants sat at the table with the board that was smeared, fell ill during the, the tournament. God damn. Uh, citing eyewitnesses adding that organizers called police after reviewing um, surveillance video that evening. The channel identified the woman who fell ill. Okay, all right. Yeah, man, this bitch, bro. Damn, competition is that tight? Did you really? I mean, damn, you 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 know what was you was your your opponent that good? I mean, but still, you know, is this a game? What's going on here? As a result, during the game, um, her health worsened. She required medical attention. However, no one else was hurt at the moment. The the lives of the participants and guests of the competitions are not in danger. See, this is Esau. They want to they because see, chess to them is a a, a a intellectual game. You know, they, 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 it's a war game. And that's Esau. Esau likes to, he, he's gifted with that sword, man. Chess is no more than a war game. You know what I'm saying? Some people are very good at it. A lot of um, your generals and, you know, uh, uh, you know, these people that run the, um, run governments and stuff like that. They're pretty good. Um, like on um, President Putin, I think he's a, a chess um, champion or some shit like that over there in Russia. A lot of these leaders, though, they're, they're pretty good at, um, you know, chess you know because it's, it's it's a it's a it's a strategic way of of war man like you know you got to be strategic to win that shit anyway though but now she took she she really took it there though like many others i am perplexed by what happened he, he added uh Said it could have led to the, the saddest outcome. Yeah, she could have killed the damn girl. Said she saw tiny balls rolling out from under her board during the tournament. She said she had no idea what it was until she realized it could have been mercury. So she alerted the organizers. I felt ill. I started breathing deeply and I could not get enough air. I could not understand what was going on. She accused uh, Amakorova Kor Korova of intentionally trying to poison her, putting many people in the building in danger. Many people could have been hurt. Mercury can be a potent poison. I never knew that. Learn something new every day, huh? The most common method of exposure is inhalation. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, which can result in respiratory sy symptoms, abdominal cramps, diarrhea, retino, reno, dysfunction visual disturbances and central nervous system damage may also occur all right anyway you see the point man i don't want to keep this long i just seen a couple stories and hey man esau out here with his competitive games and shit this man will 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 and he's a damn cheater man he's a damn cheater he's not gonna you know um, um really come at you you know um in no real way that's just like with this, you know, so-called Native American Indians, man. They had to up their game, man. When them Native American Indians is on their ass, tribe of Gad. They had, they, they had to come back with that Gatling gun. <laughs> they like, hey, these dudes, man, out here with that bow and arrow, riding on these damn horses with no saddle. They fucking us up. We got to think of something. <laughs> hey, he came with that sword. He saw us that sword, the swordsman, man. You see, even something like this, a poisoning, that's a, that's a, that's a, uh, um, in addition to his sword play. No. He uses money as a sword. He uses hey, he could turn anything into a weapon, man. He could turn your woman against against you and make her a weapon against you. Like she like how they done with the so-called blacks. He could turn your children against you. This motherfucker can weaponize food. He can weaponize the water. Look, hey, he can weaponize mosquitoes and shit, insects. Why you think they have um a central disease um control center and shit like that? What do you think they're doing when they're in them places? Instead of eradicating the shit, you think that okay we found a disease, we're gonna throw it in the incinerator so it'll never exist again. No, they play with that shit. They put it with something else. They might test it with this or test it with that. 
flying in monkeys and shit from all over the world to test shit on. Your damn Elon Musk with the brain chip shit. See, this man can weaponize anything. And this is just this is just retarded, bro. Crazy, bro. Over a damn chess game. But again, though, you can clearly see a hey, homeboy. He out of here. You know, I was thinking like, damn, nigga, you know, because when I first seen the story, I'm like, he died at the finish. You know, they said he went under and he just, you know, they was they was pretty much they was at the finish line from what they saying basically. I guess he just, you know, clumped on out, man. Shit, sometimes you, hey, you just never know how that weather will kick in because hot weather is a bad boy, man. I don't get you going out. You doing this for, for the sake of what a damn medal? Some small ass trophy to put on your 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 nightstand at the crib? I don't even think no money be involved in shit like that. Could have been some um you know a little little um prize up first second third prize or some bullshit. But that's not wise, man. You got to use wisdom, man. The scripture talks about using wisdom. That is not wise. Matter of fact, what's that it's scripture that talks about uh? It's lucky. Bear with me. Yeah, this is the one I want right here. First Corinthians six and twelve. All things are lawful unto me, but all things are not expedient. All things are lawful for me, but I would not be brought under the power of any. Right? And it's in on First Corinthians ten and twenty three. All things are lawful for me, but all things are not expedient. All things are lawful for me, but all things edify have not. Right? Let's see. Let's go into this word. Um expedient real quick Man, you ask me that shit was pretty goddamn silly what verse was it okay here we go right here just cause your family watching your doofy ass on TV I'm not coming up that word is um Simfero to bear or bring together to bear together or at the same time let me see well oh, they got a couple different um, hookups on it let's check out this etymology from with okay it says with hmm okay anyway though hey man everything is not just because you can do it man it's not wise to do it I mean golly you know you got you you got people that 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 freeze to death, you know, climbing mountains and shit. You know, Mount Ever you know, play you know, it just they, they fuck themselves. I mean it's it, and it's all to just uh yeah, well you know, I wanna I want the world record. You have a a, a a something that's called the Guinness Book of World Records here, man. With all kinds of shit in it. Cause people just wanna be noticed and people wanna be seen. I mean, it is what it is, man. I mean, you know, man's going to the Lord, you know, because he wouldn't have been able to avoid that anyway. It's just just his lot, man. But still, hey, fucked up. And and also, you know, that ought to give you a healthy fear of the Lord, Yahweh, man. It's a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living God because he probably was panicking. He, I'm sure he had to have felt himself panic, so to speak. You know what I'm saying? And and, and, and he could have had a man, look. A lot of these younger athletes, man, they're 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 passing out on 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 on, on playing. It was a young um, what's this guy? He was, I think he was like 17. This was like a, about a month or so back. I forgot what sport he was playing, but he was he was pretty young in the sport. He was real good, but he was um because he was so young. He was like the youngest player in the sport, but he was 17 years old and had just went pro, or whatever it was. But his ass ended up dying right in the on the court, you know, if you know. With the whole audience looking on. Everybody, oh my God, you know, and all that shit. Then you had this um Olympic um matter of fact, you know what? Some of this shit this uh, this guy. This Olympic guy, uh he, I think I think he 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 died um in the middle of a um you know what what's that the weightlifting shit where they be posing? I forgot what what is it, body bit, whatever the fuck that is. Uh let me see. Let me see if I can find it. I just seen that. All this, you know. I trying to did he collapse? Yep, I think this is it right here. Yep, this is it right here. This guy right here. Mm. Trying to think, was that the one? That was one just the other day. 
But hey, but you can clearly see, you know, that this didn't happen multiple times. This is a lot of people on here that this has happened to. Um, shit. Okay, they got um, they got a, somebody got a collage on here. Yep. Body builds a collapse on stage. Yeah, man. So hey, I mean, you know, they 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 go through these all this grueling shit and do a lot of shit to their bodies, man, to um overstressing themselves, you know what I'm saying, to go into these sports, man. And these are the type of people that won't even listen to the army. Like, why don't you just go to the army? They'll get your ass together. You wanna be Considered to be a hero, you want to be known, you to take your ass and go fight for your country. You know? Anyway, though, I'm going to end out there, man. I pray that this lesson was edifying. Hey, just use wisdom, man, when it comes to certain stuff. You feeling some type of way? Just take a seat, man. You know? He could have easily backed out because the lady clearly said that, you know, he did look a little bit disoriented. But, you know, yeah, that's pretty normal for, all right? But you know that pride too. That that right there. Matter of fact, that's probably what happened to this guy. He probably was so he probably was feeling it. Like, man, I can't do this shit. But that pride probably kicked in on his ass and he took his dumb ass on out there. Let me get that one real quick. We end out there. What was it? Uh Yep, Proverbs 16 and 18. Pride go before destruction and an haughty spirit before fall. See? Pride goes before destruction. Because he could have easily said, no, I'm not feeling right, bro. I'm not going to be able to continue. You know? Because they didn't say, like I said again, they didn't say like um, what was after the swim. If it was just a three-mile run and a swim, I, you know, I don't know what, what CrossFit. I don't know what the fuck you got to do to go through all that shit. I know they be going through some gruesome shit, though. But anyway, man, I'm going I'm to I'm end out there, man. I pray that this lesson was edifying with that. Come here, something. The Bible ball.